This is a construction update provided by the City of Somerville and read by the Somerville Media Center. Construction Update, Week of January 20th. Improvement Projects. Green Line Extension. Last week, crews successfully relocated the first of two commuter rail tracks to its permanent location along the east side of the MBTA right-of-way. That track is now fully operational. Starting January 17th, between the Washington Street Bridge and the Sycamore Street Bridge, crews will begin relocating the second of the two commuter rail tracks. Grading and subgrading for the second track will take place around the clock throughout the weekend. Activities will include heavy equipment movement, hauling and dumping of crushed stone, and the cutting and welding of track. Overnight noise in these areas may be disruptive at times, primarily due to the use of gasoline-powered hand tools needed to cut tracks. The final cutover for the second track is expected to take place next weekend, January 24th through the 26th. Once that is complete, the demo of the remaining span of the Washington Street Bridge will closely follow. For a detailed summary of upcoming work, take a look at the latest construction update from MassDOT. If you need assistance for a GLX construction-related matter, please call the 24-7 GLX hotline at 1-855-GLX-INFO 459-4636 or email info at glxinfo.com. Somerville Avenue Utility and Streetscape Improvements Traffic signal work has been completed in Union Square and northbound traffic can once again proceed from Webster Avenue to Bow Street. Contractors have established a work zone at the Somerville Avenue Rossmore Street intersection and expect to extend it east to the Mansfield Street intersection within the next few weeks. While those intersections are closed, motorists should enter and exit Rossmore Street and Mansfield Street via Washington Street. Somerville High School Building Project Somerville High School Building Project Concrete placement for the floors in the eastern wing will continue during the week of January 20th. Weather permitting, on Wednesday, January 22nd, crews will arrive as early as 3 a.m. to prepare for work to start as at 4 a.m. Trucks will enter and exit the site using Highland Avenue, between Vinyl Avenue and Central Library. Neighbors will be notified in advance through the city's alert system. National Water Main, the city's contractor, is rehabilitating manholes throughout Somerville through the spring of 2020. Lane closures, lane shifts, and parking restrictions may be implemented as needed. During the week of January 20th, crews plan to be on the following streets. Berwick Street, Cedar Street between Highland Avenue to Clyde Street, Clark Street, Dane Street, Elm Street from Linden Avenue to Willow Avenue, Garden Garden Court, Harrison Street, Ivalu Street, Kent Street, Leland Street, Perry Street, Prospect Street, Washington Street from Beacon Street to Webster Avenue, Webster Avenue from Washington Street to Prospect Street, Winslow Avenue, and Wyatt Circle. Additional Utility Work Utility companies are responsible for notifying residents prior to conducting any work, but we expect parking restrictions and lane shifts due to the following utility work. Detail officers may close a road if deemed necessary for safety. National Grid, Middlesex Avenue, Pearl Street and Myrtle Street. This has been a construction update by the City of Somerville and read by Somerville Media Center.